Apparently her name's Kayla Morin. Her mom's in her office. Who would do this? Who would hurt my baby? Can you verify your whereabouts in the last 72 hours? Be careful. Don't say something you'll regret. See that guy in there? That's our prime suspect. This guy doesn't make sense. I didn't kill anyone! Listen, I got your prints on the murder weapon. You tell me how they got there. Ah! Yeah. I don't know what these mean. These parallel cuts underneath the big one. Kayla killed herself. What if she saw something? Like what? Like what I've been seeing. Hope that's just a cigarette in your mouth. Hands up. Mm. Smart. Get lost. Not you. What's she doing here? Asshole. Mm. Shouldn't talk that way about your boyfriend. It'll hurt your relationship. I wasn't talking about him. <laughs> you are a lippy little thing. You know you're in a lot of trouble here? Possession, trespassing, and decency? Suppose there are ways I could not get you arrested? What are you doing? What do you mean? I haven't decided yet. He disappeared. He lay down on the grave and it's like the ground absorbed him. I still think you're sleepwalking. I wasn't sleepwalking. I checked again this morning. That grave was fresh. But the headstone wasn't. Guess what it said? Black Horse. That's Silas Black Horse. Who's that? Simon's father. But that dig's not fresh. He's been gone for what, like 18 years? 19 according to the marker. Silas was a powerful dude. Simon's mojo, he got that from his dad. Silas was a medicine man? Silas was the medicine man. I mean, personally, I think Simon helped daddy into an early grave to solidify his own power. 
Well, it worked. Simon has this town wrapped around his little finger. Are you sure that was a fresh grave? A few days max. How many grave diggers are there in town? Just one. I've been doing this for 10 years, give or take. I'm gonna need you to fill out this form. Hey, what are you doing here? Hey, uh, can I get the weed back? Are you crazy? This stuff makes you stupid. You wanna be stupid, do you, Jamie? Your mom not buy your groceries this week? She went to La Fon with her boyfriend. You got nothing? Clean what? Buy as many groceries as you can carry, okay? Make sure your mom doesn't drink up the change when she gets back. Thank you. Walk you out. Let's go. Oh, is there anyone else I should be talking to? I call in help when I need it. Has this ever happened before? No. If there's one thing Rabbit Fall respects, it's the dead. Hmm. Well, I'll meet you at the graveyard. Careful, Bob. You keep being nice to that boy, I'm gonna think you're getting soft. Why? He's a good kid. I like him. He reminds me of, uh, me. Who's the, uh, big guy? Gravedigger. Someone may have illegally buried a body at the graveyard. That's funny. I saw someone lurking around the graveyard last night. What did he look like? It wasn't him. It was a her. What's that stuff? It's a sage bundle. I'm performing a ceremony before I dig it up. Ceremony? We just dig it up. It's Simon Blackhorse's father's grave. I thought you said the grave was fresh. It is. It's on the Blackhorse plot. I think someone buried a new body on top of the old one. I'll call Blackhorse. You go dig it up. Simon. Desecrating a grave. We may have a body that's been dumped here on top of the old one. That's my father's grave. This is a slap in my face. We're just investigating. We won't exhume your father unless we absolutely have to. This could be someone we know. Someone's child. There are ceremonies, customs that need to be followed. This is bad medicine. I already performed a ceremony. You? You don't know how to do a ceremony. I should have done it. I should have been told about this. I found something. That's not good. Back behind the line. Behind the line, please. <laughs> uh. It's on your shoulders now. How'd the dig go? People were not happy. So, what are you running for office? Found a body. It's at the funeral parlor. His name is August Crinton. Oh, yeah. Any obvious cause of death? Um, some kind of disease or something. You know him? Sure. He's a big drunk. Picked him up a lot over the years. I called the coroner's office. They're gonna send several guys to pick him up. Rabbit Fall Police. Hey, it's Zoe. I'm at the clinic. 
The gravedigger's gotten a lot worse. So what is it? The nurse thinks it's a staph infection, but she's not sure. She put a call in for more antibiotics. Yeah, but is it contagious? She thinks so. I'll be in the office working on reports. Of course you are. We have talked to everyone who touched the body. That's the thing. He didn't touch the body. You have to warn people. Anybody who was at the graveyard yesterday needs to go to the clinic and get checked. I told you what you had to do at the grave. A ceremony alone won't stop this. A proper ceremony would have prevented it, though. Whoever put that body in the ground put the illness into it. That would be a very powerful person. Well, we have some very powerful medicines coming in from the city. So if you wouldn't mind, please make your way to the clinic. Why would anyone want to go there? You're safe here with me. I wouldn't count on it. You've unleashed something on all of us, and now you can't control it. You think bringing more lives here will help? Don't play with their lives. Get them to the clinic. Leave Rabbit Fall. Or their lives will rest on your soul. Bob, Bob, you gotta see this. She called me this morning. Oh. Oh, she's gotta get out of here. Get out. You stay here. Check out the graveside, do a scan or something. He won't be back from his dig for another week. Everybody thinks this is because of me. It's not your fault. There was like a poison or some kind of chemical. I have to figure out who did this. Hello? I need you. Where are you? You were right. They're sick and it's my fault. Kaseka. Papa Kaseka. I'm
damn it, Black Horse. What did you do? You wanted her out? Yeah, I wanted her out, but not a goddamn plague. You got something for this, I know it. Where is it? Do I? Should I arrest you? What do I do with this? Drink it. It's bad. Drink some more. <coughs> You're gonna be fine, okay? Let's get you home. Let me wait. <coughs> from when I was a kid. A medicine man used to brew it. We'll talk about this later. Now drink this. You look like hell. I thought you'd have left by now after what you did to this town. The cure is inside. Who do you think you are? These people wouldn't have the plague if you'd have listened to me. The cure is inside. It's inside.
You caused quite the commotion in town. They're saying you're special. <laughs> a healer. Don't say that. I'm just a cop. The black horse. You do that again, you're dead. I'm very lucky you found that plant. That plant has a story. You know it? Can't say I do. We call that plant the sister of evil. She grows right beside her brother. And he, he can be brewed to make a really scary illness. I had nothing to do with it. That's not what I saw. You saw nothing. Oh, you're wrong, medicine man. I saw everything. Mm -hmm.